Now let's talk about installing Windows 8 alongside Windows 7 and this would be as a dual boot system. So when you start up your computer it'll give you a list of operating systems you'll see Windows 7 and Windows 8. So what we have to do first is make a partition and you can do this in the disk management. Now to get to here just go to your start button and in the search type in disk management and then you'll get this window here. Okay so pick the partition or the disk where you want to partition and in this case I'm using the C drive. So right click here and click on shrink volume. Now what we want to do is make about a 25 gigabyte here which is now this is in megabytes remember so we need to multiply it by a thousand so I'm going to put 25,000 here and then I'm going to click shrink now it creates a new partition for us Okay, now you see here that we have an unallocated partition. So now I'll right click on this and we'll, we'll click New Simple Volume. Let's click Next, Next. Now we can assign a, a drive letter here. So that's fine. And now we want to format it in NTFS. We can give this a new volume here. Let's call it Win8. Click Next. And now we'll click Finish. Okay, and there we have it. We have Win8 as our new volume. Now what we're going to do is install Windows 8 in that volume. So we need our Windows 8 install DVD we just created, or I created an install stick. Now what we have to do is reboot our machine. And when we get to the boot menu, you can hit F2 and make sure that it's going to boot from your device. Your first, either your DVD, if you burned a DVD, or your stick if it's on a stick. And then go ahead and let it boot from there. And then what you're going to do is install the operating system on the new on the new partition. Okay, so I took some pictures as we went along. So when I reboot, I go into the boot menu with F10 and I pick my SanDisk disk or my stick and then it's starting to do the install okay and then Windows 8 so we just go forward from here fill it out click install now and then we agree to the terms here and continue okay next we're going to pick the install Windows only the second option then I pick the proper partition here that I just created for Win8 and install it in there and away it goes. It's now doing the install and it's getting everything ready here. Okay now when you boot you'll be able to choose which operating system Windows 8 or 7 and here it is all done and installed.